great consistency. But I should have put this in the other way. Alright. So this what we have here is Monster Mud. It's five parts joint compound. One part latex paint. Uh, it doesn't matter what color. Um, and I, I think... You know, if you use this normally without the, the latex paint in it, um, it would it would crack. And I think that the latex, my understanding is that the latex paint allows it to um, expand and not crack. Uh, but you still need to put it on in, in fairly thin layers. You can't really um, glop it on. So... I'm going to, oh yeah, it's kind of out of screen. All right, we're going to get set up. We're going to start the mountains, and then we're going to put some monster mud on it. And uh, I don't, I got a, like a day uh, to do this before my nephew gets here for Christmas. So um, I don't think we're going to finish, but we'll give it a shot. Okay. So obviously we need to have a base layer over this. We really should probably be using paper mache, um, but we're gonna try. We're gonna try it this way. I got some water here. We're gonna let this just so we could get this to have some shape. Let's see how this stuff spreads here. We don't want it too thick. We want it thick, but we want a good layer of it. But again, we don't want it too thick. And stick them really nice to this paper. I also have a spatula and a paintbrush. Uh, it's actually going on pretty good with this. Bottom here. Again, when you when you use the the cloth, here's what you do: is you dip the whole cloth into the monster mud, 
And then when you take it out, it's, it's covered in the monster mud and you just drape it over your armature. In this case, we're going to kind of, we're kind of painting it on. Um, I was considering using paper towels, but I figured that the actual newspaper would be a little bit stronger. I could get one coat on here and start the shell and then I could come back and give it a second coat and make it a little stronger, a little sturdier. And I think that would work out well. And the paint I had picked up over the summer, I think, um, it's Oops Paint from Home Depot, or Lowe's, I think it was Home Depot. And uh, I think it was like $4, $5. This latex, uh, this joint compound was $6. And I actually got a stirring paddle a while ago, but it ended up not fitting my drill, so I had a hand start, as you saw. And that's what you gotta watch out for, is getting it all over your hands. And like I said, you should work from the top down, which I am not doing. But we'll stop doing. Now, the difficult thing here is I really can't see too well of any spots that I missed. But I think that looks pretty gosh darn good. So, I think we're going to let it dry. It says it's supposed to take 24 hours. Maybe with the paint, it might be a little longer, it might be a little sooner. Really not sure. Um, I have some rock molds that I could break up and maybe put in the second layer, but we'll do that after Christmas. But uh, yeah, so that's making uh, making mountains with monster mud. We'll uh, let it dry. We'll come back in. Uh, we'll come back tomorrow afternoon. See if it's hardened at all, and go from there. Take a look. Well, I don't have my watch on, but how long did that take? 15 minutes, maybe? We got that. That over there is a uh, mountain used in the um, Plaster of Paris strips. Same with that over here. Uh, this I had done a video a while ago and obviously didn't paint it. But I did go back with some uh, Plaster of Paris um, powder and uh, made a mix and um, put a couple of layers on it just so it's a little thicker. Uh, I made some rock molds uh, using a mold. Where's the rock mold? Uh, made a couple using crumpled tin foil. Just trying to change it up a bit. This one's rovey. Got a couple of rock pieces here. Uh, on there. Okay. Right down there is a rock mold. That, we'll paint that. Uh, but yeah, I think that came out pretty good. Looks good so far with the hill. Be an open area there, or maybe we'll fill that up and you know have it reach the uh, thing, the, uh, the hill over there. Uh, so tomorrow, actually, maybe I'll clean this up now. Uh, or I could do it Christmas morning. Get the 